This time I've got a big problem. My car stopped working and I have no other option than build myself some kind of shelter to survive the freezing night. Hello everybody! This overnight will be different because I am playing a role of a stranded person in the middle of woods and in this fictional story. I don't have much gear and as you can probably see we have winds and uh, the temperature overnight should be below 30 Fahrenheit which is around 0 Celsius. We have a lot of leaves on the ground so my plan is to build some kind of uh, debris shelter and uh, let me show you what kind of equipment I have this time. So, I took from my car backpack, small. Here I have two garbage bags and oh, wood. some kind of food. Two protein bars, 20 grams of protein each. That's this pocket. This is tripod for camera and my car keys. In big pocket. Another garbage bag, so three together. I have two and a half bottles of water. This is very good fleece, big one with a hood. Also I've had in my car the Shemak. This is some kind of protection for head. And another socks. And clothes I wear are boots, small non-insulated gloves, this is the true spec parka, uh, also my pants, uh, what else, I have two t-shirts and regarding tools I have small folding knife and little flashlight. These are items I always wear with me wherever I go. It's around uh, one o'clock in the afternoon, so I have let's say five hours to get prepared. Currently we have around 50 Fahrenheit, which is 10 uh, Celsius, but the wind is around 15 miles per hour, which is not helping at all. I forgot to mention, I didn't take any fire starting equipment or helpers, and also I cannot start fire here. I have to stay hidden, that's the rule. It's gonna be a hell of a trip. <laughs> I think I found my home for tonight. Check this out. It's completely hollow. And now I just need to decide if I will go inside and sleep in it as it is. That means I would probably need to sit or try to, you see, it's, it's rocking back and forth. So I should be able to knock this down and use it as a tube. So that's the decision to make. I decided first to eat something to have some kind of energy before I will build.
I made a decision to put it down and use it as a tube for sleeping. Hopefully that was a good idea. And I need to get this piece as well to be able to put it back. At this point, when I harvested that piece, which goes on top here, and I need to turn the entire thing this way, so my feet will be covered from the top. Now let's see if I can even fit inside. Excellent! I want to use two garbage bags to make some kind of sleeping bag and the third one to cover the front hall. First collection of leaves, it's not much because I don't have a good area here for leaves, but it should be enough to fill out the end uh, of the shelter. Second bag, this one should take care of the insulation from the bottom. And this will be barrier over here to keep the leaves inside so they do not slide out. And now I want to start with the sleeping bag idea by putting two garbage bags together, just tie them up by these sides at the ends and lay it on the uh, first layer of leaves and put another layer on top of it and uh, when I will be done I will just crawl inside uh, these two garbage bags so it'll be like sleeping bag something like that so here are the garbage bags tied together as you see like one I know there are holes but I cannot do it any other way otherwise the opening from this one to that one would be too small. And when I'm ready to get inside the shelter I will just make a hole here and that's all. And before I will empty the third bag I want to show you I add another barrier to make this higher and I will continue to completely fill out this portion to make this opening smaller. This will be cozy. Okay, as you can see I have the last bag installed so I can just take it out if needed and crawl inside the shelter. Now it's around 6 o'clock so I will probably relax a little bit and eat maybe half of the protein bar and uh, get ready for tonight. Also I hope it's obvious that I am hungry as a dog and I will miss my noodles and beef jerky. Okay I finished half of the bar and as you see the light is slowly fading. I am getting colder. As I checked uh, last time, the temperature should be around 28, around 7 a.m. tomorrow. So it's, it's gonna be cold without any sleeping bag. 
Now I will prepare my feet for tonight. I will put on each foot plastic bag and another sock on top of it. So here I am making the hole in the plastic in the back. I'm not making it all the way here but let's say 10 inches below so I can put my head inside this part if needed okay guys I am inside the shelter it feeling warm and protected so if something I will get back to you otherwise see you in the morning good morning everybody it's around 6 30 and I am Feeling those chills since let's say 4 o'clock when the temperature really got low below 30 let's say around 0 for uh, Celsius and I need to warm up and Much better, but one thing was great, I didn't need to pee for entire night, it was excellent. And when I went inside the shelter, I realized I forgot to put this piece on this side. But it was not a big problem, but a lesson for me for sure. So we have 7.35 a.m. which is hour after sunrise and now I have 30 degrees Fahrenheit which is a little bit below zero Celsius. So as you see 30 Fahrenheit is not that cold but uh, for sleeping in the old tree trunk without any sleeping bag or sleep mattress uh, is is not that warm <laughs> and uh, I really feel the chill this morning as you see so winter is coming and as you probably know winter is my favorite part of the year so there will be more videos uh, on snow hopefully and uh, also I promised some video about uh, car storage uh, working on it still and I hope you enjoyed this episode uh, same as I did even the shelter was not that much comfortable as I expected but kept me warm and I survived the night that's the goal of this uh, pretended scenario and uh, if you like that you can subscribe to my channel there will be more videos like this and also thank you for watching and the entire support to my channel take care guys